my YouTube. So today I have a haul video. Uh, most of these products are from Korea, but I do have like two products that I bought before I left to Korea. So I will start off with those. The first thing I have is this NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick. And this is in the color 12. Just looks like that. And it is actually on my lips right now. So I really recommend this color because if you're looking for like a dark lip color that is still on the natural side, uh, I really recommend this because it doesn't have any like bright red, orangey undertones. It's more like a brown undertone. So this was about $7. And the lasting power for this lipstick is about three hours. It all depends on if you're eating and like drinking a lot of food, but if you're not, I would say it could last for a very long time. The next thing I have is a hat and this hat was from Etsy. Um, this is what it looks like. It says, yes I know guac is extra. So that's what it looks like on. Uh, I thought it was really cute because whenever I'm at Chipotle, like, I want to get the guacamole, but it's like $3, so I'm like, I just, I always want to get it, but I just never do. So I thought that hat was very uh, relatable. And now I'll show you guys the things that I got from Korea. The first thing I got is from Hongdae, and it's just this hat. Next thing I have is a headband, and this was $5 from... It was like in a souvenir shop. You can kind of adjust it to like go up and to be shorter. So I thought this was very cute. Now I'm gonna move on to clothes. First thing I have is a basic tee and this was $12 or $10 uh, from the subway station. When I got off my stop, I was supposed to go straight to my aunt's house, but of course I had to be lured in by the stores Next is this long sleeve cropped shirt that this was I think six dollars And yeah, so this is the next shirt uh, It's like a suede material. So I thought it would be a lot more expensive, but it was $15 from home day and now I have a t-shirt and this was from a shopping area in Seoul called Tongdaemun Now I have a long sleeve tee from Forever 21, just like that. I thought this shirt was cute because it has like an X in the front and it was very like elegant. Um, this shirt was I think around $24. I think now I can move on to skin products. So first I'm gonna go over my new skincare routine that I brought over from Korea. Uh, all these products are from Innisfree. And I switched my skincare routine because when I went to Korea, I think my skin wasn't used to like the water. So I was breaking out like all over my face. So I just switched all my products and it has been doing wonders for all the little acne. I have like the um, white heads on my forehead, the pimples on my face right here. So first thing is this blueberry rebalancing face wash from Innisfree and this was I think $7 or $8 and before I purchased this I looked it up online to see if it was like reputable uh, and someone actually did a pH test to this face wash and it was actually uh, it was around 5.5 next thing I used before I put on my lotion is this serum this is the Innisfree Green Tea Seed Serum. I noticed that it makes my skin very soft before I put on my lotion. So I really, really like this. And it smells so good. I think it was around $20. And then next I have the Innisfree Bija Trouble Lotion. I think this is the reason why the acne on my forehead has been clearing up. This was about $10 or less. And now I have a hair oil that I wanted to talk about. This is from Nature Republic and it is the Hair Essence Argan. And this was around $10. Don't know if it's amazing for my hair, but the smell is honestly what drew me in. Like the smell is so amazing. Next I have this Innisfree Jeju Volcanic Clay Mousse Mask. So it's basically just like a clay mask in a bottle. So it just looks like that. 
And this clay mask is okay. I didn't really see it do anything crazy for my skin, but it's nicer for when you have like a lot of oil. Uh, rather than if you have like good skin at the time and like you don't really have any pimples, I recommend that you don't use this because it's a little bit on the harsher side. And then next I have these cute, very cute lip balms. It looks like that. The company is called On The Body. The first one has vitamin E, and this is like a green apple flavor, which smells so good. And then this one is vitamin B, but it doesn't have any flavor. Okay, so I think that is everything for my haul. Uh, thank you so much for watching, and if you want to see any more videos, and if you have any requests, just leave it down below, and I will try to get everything done. Bye, guys!